Welcome to the WVU Football Pre-Game Chat on the Depost.com. I'm Todd Murray along with our football writer Ed Owens. And Ed, tonight the Mountaineers hosting number 17 Kansas State here at Milan Pushkar Stadium. Uh, the Mountaineers trying to get to that seventh win, Kansas State, of course, uh, with a lot to to play for here, you know, both teams a lot at stake. Huh? Yeah, absolutely. For WVU in particular, I think, I mean, Kansas State, they've already, they're in that second tier of, of the Big 12. They're not going to be the college football playoff representative, but they're still going to finish near the top of the conference. WVU, this, this is kind of a make or break game for them. I think this is the difference between winning and going to a bowl game that they'll enjoy or losing and ending up in a bowl game where everyone's miserable. A couple times this week I've kind of compared it to the 2012 season where WVU hit that slide and they ended up in the pinstripe bowl and no one was happy about it. This week you have to look at it. I mean if they lose tonight they, they've lost three in a row. You're heading to Iowa where, where anything can happen in the finale and, and you're going to be in a bowl game no one's happy about. I think it's really important WVU comes out and, and has the game they want to have tonight in order to, to salvage the season. They started off really well. All right. What's going to be the toughest part of, of this matchup for the teams? I think for WVU, it's, it's definitely Bill Snyder and, and the discipline he's instilled in Kansas State. I mean, this is a team that everyone all week has talked about. They do not beat themselves. They don't force the ball in places they shouldn't. They don't blow coverages on defense. They're not going to blow you away. They're not going to trick you, but they are just fundamentally sound. They do what they do, and they do it well. Uh, they're also not a team that's going to take a lot of penalties. Um, they lead the conference in, in fewest penalties right now, something WVU struggled with at times, and, and really discipline is something WVU struggled with at times. They've shot themselves in the foot on a number of occasions this year. They need to play a really clean game against Kansas State. Right. This Kansas State defense, uh, nothing flashy. They, they don't get fancy, they're, they're just, but they're very solid in what they do. Right? And nothing flashy, they're just good. Uh, they're, they're not going to, like I said before, they're not going to trick you. They're not going to go out of their way to throw a lot of different disguised coverages at you what they're going to do is is line up and say come beat us uh and so far not too many teams have really been able to do that kansas state top two or three in the conference in just about every statistical category and they really looking at their statistics remind me a lot of texas uh at, at least in terms of the numbers so i think that should be concerning for wvu who really struggled against texas had a hard time getting anything going against the longhorns 10 points in that loss lowest of the season uh they they really need to come out this offense i hope use the bye week well and, and comes out firing All right, wvu and kansas state tonight at milan pushstar stadium thank you for watching and please continue to follow our wvu football coverage on the depost.com